Our ability to understand the mechanisms of disease requires our ability to understand, at least in part, how mutations actually change the activity of proteins because the effect of mutations that ultimately cause disease and so on works through changes in actions of the proteins. For a long time we've been dreaming of an approach to be able to watch proteins in action. Practically to make it work it involved the creation of a whole new technology because nothing existed for doing this experiment. Nobody had actually ever done this experiment and we know from basic physics that if you put a big electric pulse or electric field on a charge, it'll put a force on it and make it move. The simple idea we had is that to subject proteins to a very large electric field, large enough that we can stimulate a lot of the motions, and then we see the protein structure by the usual approach we use to see structures, which is a method called X-ray diffraction. So by subjecting proteins to X-rays, we can see their structure. By subjecting it to the electric field, we can stimulate the motions. And by putting the two things together, we get to stimulate motions in proteins and watch the protein move with atomic resolution. We can basically make many snapshots in time, and it's like building up a movie, but now what we have to do is to put it to work to really explain how proteins work. And that's really the research goal for the next several years, is to develop this experiment further. 